This is the 2003 Honda Civic. I've been messing with this slave cylinder for a while. And I couldn't get it to work. I think everybody's had this experience that has worked on this. When you change them out, the lines fill up full of air and you can't get them to work. I even, I even took the master cylinder out. The master cylinder on these cars, almost impossible to reach, but it's way down in there. Follow that line right there. And you can kind of see it. Well, I managed to get it out, tested the master cylinder, and then reinstalled it. Yes, it comes out, comes out through this hole right here. Wasn't easy, but I did it. When you, if you do do a master cylinder, take your wheel off and you can get access through this space right here. That will help you out. So I started to bleed this, having all kinds of trouble. Well, here's what I did. I put a vice grip on the new, mat, the new slave cylinder so that I can access it with two hands. Fill the reservoir and then compress the ram with the valve open to get the air out. Then close the bleeder and let the piston out. And when that happens, it draws fluid from your reservoir. Then tighten up your bleeder and then open the bleeder and press the piston and out will come air and fluid. Before you let the piston back out, tighten up the bleeder. I'll see if I can get a video of me doing it. Now I've already bled this slave cylinder, but what you're gonna do is with the reservoir over here filled, you're going to depress the piston and then at the same time, open the bleeder and you'll get air and fluid. Right now, I'm only getting fluid. Here we go. So I'm just getting fluid right now. I was getting a lot of air. Now with the piston compressed, tighten up this bleeder and then let it out and watch the reservoir draw your fluid level down because it's drawing through the line it's draw through this line it's drawing more fluid gonna put some more in there okay so now the piston is out the, the rod is out and i'm going to push the rod and i'm going to open the bleeder again and i'll again i'm only going to get fluid i was getting a lot of air here we go i'm pushing the rod it's all fluid 10 minutes ago, it was all air. Tighten it back up like this and then let out the piston. And now when I let it out, it draws fluid from the reservoir. It worked really well. And also note that I took this out and I clamped it right here. I didn't clamp it real tight, but I can access it with two hands. I'm telling you, this little trick really worked. I got a lot of air out of this system by doing that. I hope this helps.